just don't see the point. If, if something's been done a million times, why do it again? Try something different, you know? Just try it. I mean, the worse you, you get shot down. I became an actor by mistake. I really did. It just sort of happened. Nah, I'd rather, I'd rather go back to pumping gas. And then the fact that you have a 20-year 20, 20 career of failures and then you do a pirate movie and that buys you an island is pretty, I mean, the irony of that. People think of you or project you to be. None of it matters. Oh, my, 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 you know, my, my drug of choice is YouTube. Artistic integrity. Well, where, where, where did you come up with that? You're not artistic and you have no integrity. You know, you really need some... Art support discount code. Check the comments. Art support. I just don't feel that an actor can be an artist. I, th I feel, and it's, it's, uh, it, it's unfortunate. I wish I, I wish I could. I wish I could think of myself as an artist. But it doesn't mean you can't approach the work with the need or desperation or passion of, of an artist. I do approach the work in that way. I mean, it, it's, there, it's passion, certainly. Art, I, I, I would say I would aspire to be able to do something that's considered art. I'm not sure that that can be done in the movie industry, the movie business, because of that fact. It's the movie business. Um, if you're aware of it, your madness or your insanity, it can be quite painful. If you're not aware of it, what a guess. That's the key. If you have it, you have it. If you don't have it, great. Don't romanticize it. Present yourself as something. But use it and deal with it and, and find it. a way to make it, find a make, make it part it. of your life in a productive way. It's your way. truth. If somebody's a little worried about what I'm doing, then I think I might be doing it. You must be doing something right. Must be doing it right. Whatever your day is, whatever you're doing, whatever your job is, whatever people think of you or project you to be, None of it matters until you look round and see people who are in need. If, if we could celebrate every breath that we take, because nothing's a guarantee, if we could celebrate the breath and the exhale, which is being alive. There are things that are very, very important in life that we we just, we don't think about, you know? And, the, and one of the most worrisome things that I, that I went through for years is you freaked, up, freaked out about your past, you're worried, you're scared to death of the future, and that's all you're thinking about. But the now doesn't exist. Everything that hap had happened to me in my life, every experience, bad, good, whatever, difficult, uh, emotional. I, I knew that that needed to be accepted to incorporate it into my life because otherwise I would be in the bug house. There were other things that I probably should have done. Not from my perspective. I mean, from my point of view, I did the right things. Every, every film that I've done, I'm happy that I, that I made that choice. I don't have any regrets whatsoever. I should have done a few other things that I didn't do, but I'm glad I didn't do them. I mean, and if you get hit, you get hit, or, or, or maybe you make it through, uh, you, you never know. But I mean, I, I just know that somebody handed me the ball at a certain point, and I was hungry enough to keep running, um, and I'm still running. I have faith that, you know, as long as you keep moving forward, just keep walking forward, things would be all right, I suppose, you know. In the early days, like I said earlier, I was, uh, I did films because uh, I had to pay the rent, you know, and I never had any aspirations of becoming an actor until I realized I was on that road and there was no turning back. I'm still not sure if I ever made the decision to become an actor. <laughs> it's what I do, and it's been very good to me. I came into, I came, you know, I, I became an actor by mistake. I really did. It just sort of happened. So for the first couple of years, I really just was doing these movies to for somebody who's going to give me money. Would you like being an actor? I do, most of the time. <laughs> most of the time. I mean, there are, there are some occupational hazards that I, I could live without. Filling out job applications for just various, like, video stores or anywhere, you know, and, and I happened to be with uh, an old buddy of mine, Nicolas Cage, uh, and 
who was who was you know then coming up the ranks and he said you know why don't you just uh, I think you should meet my agent you should investigate um, acting you hadn't thought of it did I? no not really no no and so I met his agent she sent me to read for a part and um, got a call back and then they hired me I was pumping gas most definitely and printing t-shirts and selling ink pens and you know I mean every every any anything and everything yeah and then the fact that you have a 20 a 20 year career of failures and then you do a pirate movie and that buys you an island is pretty I mean the irony of that is pretty <laughs> but I I would hate to have to say that I'm limited just to be an actor I would hate to limit myself as as, as me as yeah. a human to to say yeah, well, yeah I'm an actor and that's it or and you went to play music when you quit school you didn't go to become an actor well I I already I was already I started playing the guitar at the age of 12 I felt a a a, a passion for it that uh, yeah it was the first real passion that I that I that I had and it was the only solace it was the only Sanctuary. It was the only security. It was the. It was my first love. Now, now you draw now too. Did you did you draw then as well? Did you have you always been drawing as well? Yeah, I always did. Uh, like you know, I remember being maybe 14, 15 years old and being fascinated with Vincent Van Gogh. I, I remember being fascinated with Jack Kerouac and reading On the Road at a very young age. As I said, it's a great job. It's one of the best jobs I've ever had. But I mean, there are other things. I just don't see the point. If, if something's been done a million times, why do it again? Try something different, you know. Just try it. I mean, the worse you, you get shot down. But. And I was, without question, a product. Not my own product, I was somebody else's product. And they shoved me down the throats of America. And I swore to myself that when I got off that show, I, uh, I would do what I wanted the way I wanted to do it. And I stick to that. So if I had to do the leading man things just to just to continue to be an actor, to continue to work, nah, I'd rather I'd rather go back to pumping gas. I, be, I believe in, in giving everything you can to the character, you know, and, and uh, 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 applying every truth that you have to the character. There's a great protection that one can use in terms of your approach to your character. There's a circle around you that no one can come into, which is, this is my choice for the character. Felt I had something to offer. You did? I wasn't sure if I was right or wrong, but I knew that I had to try, and I knew that that was going to require paving or actually hacking your way. I can do anything as a character, as myself. Um, and do, do you think you need I that? I crumble. Do hmm? you think you need that, that freedom that you get as a character? Oh, I, I definitely need it. They did not have the luxury of words. It's easy to say I love you. But if it's not behind the eyes, if it's not in there, if it's not your truth uh, that you've applied from whatever you got, then it's, then it's bullshit and uh, the audience will see it. <laughs> oh, I think you learn every time out of the gate. I think, that's the, I think that's the thrilling thing about the process is that every time you're out there and you give it a shot, you know, with a character that might make people a little nervous initially, especially people with wa their wallets involved, the process itself is, is a gas. Uh, uh, and you're out there trying to do something different each time because each, try, each time you try something different, you're stretching, you're stretching out a bit. I knew you'd warm up to me. I'm very happy to explore all possibilities of a character and, and really, you know, uh, uh, dive in um, to, um, to the role. I mean, to the point of where, you know, Disney wanted to, wanted to fire me. They wanted to fire you from pirates? Yeah. Because? They couldn't understand what I was doing, you know. They didn't understand the character. They, they were actually were contemplating subtitling the film, you know. <laughs> <laughs>